terminal keypad to have access to the terminal customization menu. Select the map visualization on the third quarter and click on the green tick to confirm. Now click on the extend button on the bottom left part of the quarter to switch to full view visualization of your map. Starting from the top left, moving to the right, you have the indicator of the signal coverage of the antenna, the button with the combined silhouette to switch between waylines visualization of the field, the digits inside the box will show the offset from the selected wayline. Looking at the map, the graphical visualization of the wayline shows your yellow or red lines. Each color represents the travel direction. The line you are following will be thicker compared to the others. The digit in yellow below the box is the wayline number. The steer wheel icon shows the steering status. White with a red cross on it means that the system is not ready for the operation. White only means ready to the operation. Orange means that the automatic steering has been activated but not all conditions are satisfied. Green automatic steering is active. If a failure occurs, the icon with a red triangle on it will appear. Magnifying glass. Use it to adjust the zoom of the map as well as the 2D or 3D visualization. On the right side of the screen, starting from the top, you find the icon to set a boundary on your field, the icon to set a new wayline, the icon to set an obstacle in the field, the icon to set a marker, the icon to enter the advanced settings of map visualization, and at last, the icon to switch back to quarter visualization. On the bottom of the screen, you find a box to visualize different layers of your worked area. In the middle of the map, you see the combined silhouette and the header sections. If you have the automatic section control activated, the green dots will switch to white if you overlap an area already harvested. In this way, the overlap will not be recorded into the hectare counter.